Let's take a look. Super. All right. I did see a 6P there, so I need to be cautious about around her neutral because she's going to use 6P. Good 6 feet. Oh no, here we go. Go for the throw because that's the only option she can't burst on. I just threw, yep. Yeah. She's using the um, the plus on block rope. I need to watch out for that interrupter. Do super, just get some damage on the board. Make it a level, play level playing field. I try to do Grave Reaper, I think, and I just um, exploded for it. Mash 5P. I didn't I couldn't tell what side she was going to go there so I just hit 5p I think she mucked up honestly right then I don't know what she wanted to do in the corner maybe Yozansen I'm not sure Nice. Oh, I needed FD that. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention. She chipped us out. If I didn't charge that, I would have anti her. I just literally threw that round. I looked at the meter and um, yeah, I saw Viking's meter and thought it was my meter. That was just stupid. I could have won that round, maybe pulled that match back. Yeah, it's plus if you just look low enough. Super, yeah.
Oh, that's not going to combo. I should have did the other one. I got greedy. I looked to end the fight straight away. Oh no! Oh, I almost threw that there. I tried to RC to get into range to um, get that 5k to kill, but damn it. If I did fast RC there, I probably could have killed. If I did like fast RC Faris, I think it might have worked. I was just out of range though. I was really sloppy that match. Not as good as I've been in some of my previous matches today, unfortunately. That was a really high level biking as well. Biking's like so weird for me. Like some matches I can fight a. Uh, really well and then some matches i come up against like low level bikers who do the most basic stuff and i just get absolutely snowballed and i can't do anything she's a really weird character to fight with testament honestly it's just the risk reward in some situations is just so like massively in her advantage that um yeah just interacting in those situations is like very dangerous but that was a really good set and that was a really high level bike and i'm Really surprised I actually won those um, two matches. I was fully expecting to lose that set 3 0. Gonna watch it back though. I think I can learn some stuff from it. Good games, Viking. Well played, man. Okay, Bridget. Yeah, it was uh, unnecessarily risky. I ain't dealing with that mix, if I can help it. Got ya. Alright. Took two bars to get out of her mix, but uh, it's worth it if I get the round. Crap, I tried to unholy dive at Antia there, too slow. Would have preferred to keep the corner actually, I think. Gotcha, caught the back dash. I recognise she was backdashing a lot on wake up because of um, you know the spacing. I think she knew I couldn't get a meaty, so she was just backdashing to go through whatever big normal I hit. But if I hit a very active normal or a slow slow normal, I can uh, catch that backdash. So that's an option. I will present more if she keeps doing it. That was unfortunate. Try to backdash there, thinking of throws coming. No. Oh, the two kills out of range. I should have did it to us. That's unfortunate. Oh, I try to hit Faris. Yeah, my buttons are slower than hers. It's not a big 
Ah, oh, I thought she was going to jump as well. Gotcha. Oh, this is really weird in this matchup, man. She kind of outranges us with my pokes, so it's kind of hard to, like deal with that backdash in some situations because she keeps um, backdashing off but I have to go into my pokes early to kind of beat hers yeah like that and if I do a big pork there I just kind of like lose if she just hits anything yeah She's not using DP at all. I don't know why I'm like baiting DPs on wake up when she's just not using them. I shouldn't be doing that. I keep looking for the DP on wake up and she's just she's just flat out not using it, so I don't know why I'm Yeah, she's oh, I need to figure out this backdash in game, man. but I don't know if I can actually get a wall break from this. I could. Gotcha. Alright, I can't believe I got that round. That was so close. Try to hit 5p there to get like a bigger reward. Oh, it's not going to kill. Oh, it sucks. Gotcha. All right, that was a bit better. She really, really wanted to use backdash, and uh, I wasn't really punishing her for using it too much. I think I did better in that third match, honestly. Just kind of, um, she was trying to backdash my porks, like my forest a lot. So if I just did like forest with into forest, it seemed to work there because she was just like backdashing, 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 and then occasionally hitting forest. You know, so uh, I think my porks in terms of like a pork war, if we both hit them at the same time, or roughly at the same time, mine will win. I think mine are more disjointed, I'm not sure. So I think I just need to go for like um, like that type of approach of just, you know, making my porks beat hers. She was backdashing a lot, and I, I tried in that um, that first match to to check her backdash with 6H, but then she started just doing forest, and that was beating my 6H, so... I'm going to have to watch that back and see, um, like try and analyze more what she was doing specifically and see if I can like recreate it in the dojo and see what options I can actually use to punish that because um, without stain state punishing backdashes if I don't use like 6H and stuff like that is actually kind of tricky because testament doesn't convert too well from just regular hits at least like mid-range regular hits so I'm going to have to take a look at that and see what I can get but good games Bridget man well played I don't really play that matchup very often especially with Bridget being one of the uh, newer characters I don't see her too much so it's some good practice Good games, Bridget. Well played. That might be the last set in this video. If it is, I hope you enjoyed, and thanks for watching.